Our guest one. Hey! What is it? Bonda. 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 I don't understand. Head what? So you know, she got me in the very fine name. Who will tell me now? What is it? Hey! Wow, Joka. I thought John didn't murder you. Who will tell me? What is it now? Okay, I will tell you. Hmm? The missing prince is back. Alongside your cross, Chiamaka. Bamu hmm. Are you serious? That's not even the main gist. Hey! What is this now? What is the gist? Nah, tell me now. God, I can't believe this. Mm. Somebody should wake me up because I am dreaming. Do you, you tell know, me now? Do you know who is behind her disappearance? Who? Who? Ndidi Amaka. Our own Ndidi Amaka. You must be joking, right? Our friend Ndidi Amaka. Hey! Hey! To think that she's even the one that will start crying. Sit down. God. Ah. What is. Mm, God, please. Let nothing happen to my friend. Let this. This girl is mean! She conspired with Princess Adugo, the princess of Amanze Kingdom, to kidnap her. Hey! Hey! Are you serious? So, wait, wait, wait. The Yamaka is this evil? You don't know. Hey! So, you mean she's been pretending to be what she's not? How can she do this to her friend now? Jealousy! Wickedness! You know what? Envy! I'm coming! I'm coming. You need to tell me! You know what? Just hey. sit down, sit down, sit down, I'm coming! Hey! Ah, 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 ah. You need to tell me everything in full, I'm coming! Put up, put up, put up, put up. The gist is still more Come out! Obina, how dare you? How dare you kneel before that girl? Do you know that your action is capable of disqualifying you from being the heir apparent to the throne? If the royal council members hear of it, are you aware? Be careful, son. I do not want that girl any inch close to you again. I want you that nothing can come between both of you. But you are adamant. You are adamant, you don't want to listen to your father. If a prince wants to choose a wife, he must follow the royal process of choosing a wife and that entails that the groom must approve the bride and he must be chosen by them. That was exactly how I married your mother. That was exactly how I got married to your mother. My parents approved and I complied. That is exactly what I want you to do in this situation, son. Son, I am going to get you a worthy bride that is going to be your wife. Yes. Yes. Our choice. My choice. Father. I will not marry your choice. Be warned, son. Be warned. I'm warning you for the last time because your disobedience will only provoke the beast in me. And I will not be lenient in disciplining you. But father, you must obey me. You must obey me or you face the consequences of disobedience. It is an order. God's sake, Father, I have told you repeatedly that I cannot marry another. It is Chiamaka that I'm in love with. And that your choice is unacceptable by me. I don't know why you want me to repeat myself. That girl is a no option, and that is final. No option? Father, you see that your no option is my desire. I'm the one who's going to settle down with a wife here and not you. I'm the one who's going to be wearing the shoes and not you. So you cannot force a wife on me. The only right you have is the role of a father-in-law to the woman that I desire to get married to. So you cannot force a wife on me. Because the last time I checked, 
the one you tried forcing on me was a total regret and I will not subject myself to any form of regret. Love is about bond and not about pride and selfish interest. Obina, do you still realize that I am your father, the king of Omunya Kingdom? Not when my happiness and future are involved. Please, listen to your father. Because what he is doing is for your best interest. Yes. You have to listen to him. Please, I'm begging you. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised at your conclusion. It is you people's plan, right? But trust me, this will not work. Some nights, the heart is beclouded with bitterness and afflictions, just like the darkness blinds the beautiful sunshine. However, just a matter of time, and the beautiful sunshine shall rise again. Then, all the bitterness and sadness will be gone with each season and time. May I sit with my most charming prince? Please do. Thank you, my prince. My prince, the night may seem so long, but it does not last forever. Do not allow the fear of the night blind you from the beauty of the sunshine. Patience. Just a little patience and courage. The dawn is almost done. I need you to retire to your bed and meditate on every word I've said. I believe they will heal your broken heart. My prince, you need to rest to face the challenges ahead. The body also needs peace. Mrs. Akuna. Yes, my prince. Thank you for your words, kind words. Your words have already strengthened me. But you don't have to worry, I'll take care of myself. Thank you, my prince. I noticed the intimacy between you and my son for a while now. I equally noticed that he confines on you whenever he's troubled. I must say I appreciate that. I appreciate the role you play in his life, but I want you to do more. I want you to talk to my son in the language that he will understand. 
advised him to stop his relationship with that young girl, Amaka. Tell him the dare consequences of disobeying royal rules. Because you've been in this royal household for a while, for a very long time now, and you should know the royal status quo. Tell my son that the aftermath of disobeying me may not be rosy. It will not be good for both of us. Talk to him. Okay, Your Majesty. I've heard what you said. I will try my best to make sure I digest your message to him. Don't just digest it. Convince him beyond every reasonable doubt. Talk to him. Yes, Your Majesty. I've heard what you said. I will do exactly what you said. Your wish is my command, Your Majesty. True love never lies. Thank you, Your Majesty. True love never fails. No matter what it faces, true love must remain. Long live your highness. You summoned me. Sit. Thank you, your highness. I invited you here for something of great concern to me. I want to have heart to heart talk with you since my son is not around now. I understand you feel something for my son. I equally understand that you've passed through a lot of travail, courtesy of what you feel for my son. However, I would like you to understand that that feeling is not to the best of your knowledge. It will never yield any positive result or lead to any potent destination. Please. Leave my son alone to concentrate on royalty. I want you to note that circumstances and fate made it that both of you cannot cross paths. Stop distracting my son to face the royal responsibility that is on his shoulders. I am a very kind man. And I would like to extend my long arm of magnanimity and kindness to you by asking you to name your price and I will pay you off. I will pay you off to leave my son alone. Your Highness, I might not know much about life, but I know that love is priceless. I know that true love is a gift of nature. I have neither silver nor gold. But I know that true love is more precious than all the treasures of the earth. I am poor. I came from a very poor background. I am not royalty. But I equally know that love is beyond class, status, and affluence. Your Highness, I cannot betray my emotions. My love for Prince Obina is priceless. With all due respect, my King, your money cannot buy my love. Your Highness, with all due respect is another form of disrespect. I've been trying to listen to you, thinking you're going to make sense. But no, you are stubborn as your father. You left me with no other option than to make it severe for you and unfortunately my son too. Leave. Be gone! Oh, 
been now. Nobody's steps on the tail of Cobra without getting hot. Father! I saw Chiamaka leaving angrily. What did you say to her? I told her the truth. And the same truth I'm going to tell you right now. Sit down. Sit down! What is going on here? It's good that you're here. You two sit down. I said, sit down, Obina. You've chosen to disobey me because of your lust and cowardice. I've come up with a solution, and the choice is yours. And that is the only way we solve this problem. You must stop whatever relationship you have with that low class girl. Or you cease to be my son. And I promise you, you will never have anything to do with the royalty. You will never be a member of this royal household. But you think I am joking and you want to continue. I will not hesitate to confiscate everything that you have gotten from me, from your clothes to your hair sheep. I wouldn't mind to froze your bank account. Open oh, the choice is yours. Obina, listen to your father, please. I'd rather lose everything and follow my heart. That is your choice. Your Highness, please. Don't do this. Now, Obina, leave this place this moment. Get out! You think you've hurt me? No. You have only given me a breath of freedom. Obina, you are talking to your father. Mind how you address me. And I want you to know that you are nothing but an outcast now. I'm not afraid of you, father or king. You can order your guards to kill me. I don't care. Obina. Please, please, don't do this. Igwe, please, both of you should stop this. You should just stop it. Not to worry, Mom. I'll be fine. I'll take my leave. Obina, come back here. Okay. And the phone. Be gone. I promise you, you will never see my feet in this palace again. And don't dare step your miserable foot to this palace again. Obina! Igwe, what is the meaning of this? Eh? Come back here and sit. True love never lies. True love never fails. No matter what it faces, true love must remain. True love never lies. True love never fails. No matter what it faces, true love must remain. What will be, will be.
My prince, my prince, I'm sorry. I heard everything. Don't feel bad because the decision you took now is the best decision ever. With time, you will realize how brave you are. May God and love guide your paths, my prince. Mrs. Zakuna. Yes, my prince. Thank you very much. Thank you, my prince. Uh, my prince, wait. My prince, I know you. You have nothing on you now. My prince, please, just manage this. No, thank you. I'll be fine. No, my prince. I insist. Please, my prince. Sometimes I wonder if I can ever get a better wife. Mm -hmm. My prince. My prince, welcome. You're welcome. Thank you very much. And good to you, sir. Uh, we are at the table already. Please. Uh, uh, See now, let's get you some. Oh, no, no, no. Thanks. Thanks for your hospitality. I'm here to see Chia Maka. Mm. Oh, oh, she's eating at the backyard. Yes. At the back. Yes. Oh, so, uh, should I call her for you? No, no. I'll be fine. I'll meet her myself. I guess I have to talk to you two later. Okay. All right. Excuse me. Welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. My love. Please, I need some time alone to clear my head. Please. I understand exactly what you've been passing through for me. And all what my father has said to you. But please, we need to talk. And we need to talk urgently. Not now. I'm not in the right mood. But I'm afraid if you don't give me an audience, I guess you will not be seeing me anytime soon. I'll be gone forever. I rejected my family way before they excommunicated me. You did what? Goodness. Could you reject your family because of me? I can reject the entire world because of you. I can even reject my own life because of you. Nothing matters to me than being with you. I'm lost without you. So what do you want to do now? What's the plan? Where do you intend to go from here? I wish I have a plan. I wish I had a destination. But I guess uncertainty will lead me through. As long as our love is bounded together. That's it. That's all. 
Then stay here with me. Stay here with us. I will explain to my parents. They will understand. Please. That wouldn't be a good idea. If the king finds out that I'm here, I will only be endangering their lives. So please. In that case, I'll go with you. Yes, it's our journey, our fate. Wherever you go, I go. No, no, darling, you can't. I will have to go alone. When I put myself together, I will come back for you, I promise you. No, my love. You rejected everything because of me. Your crown, your comfort, everything. Love is sacrifice. Together, we will conquer. I will go with you. Don't say no, please. You really made up your mind on this? Yes. So what about your parents? Leave them to me. Can't you learn me something to pick? You know? mm. I'm worried. There's nothing like to pick. You know? No, I'm not going to My friend. Ah, ah. Hey, Chia Maka. Chia Maka. This one you're carrying your traveling bag. Where are you going? Mother. Father. I'm sorry for the short notice. But I'm leaving with my prince. What? You know what? I don't understand. What do you mean going with my prince? To where? Why? Yay! Father, he has been disowned by his father. Evicted from the royal household. So wherever he goes, I go. Yeah, she's right. I'm no more prince. Now that I'm a part of the royal household. Sorry. Mm. Such a quite pathetic, uh, especially when you have to fall into the predicament because of your feelings for my daughter. Mm. Mm. However, I cannot allow you go with her. Mm. Her being around you has caused us a lot of misery. Mm. And uh, I don't want it to continue. I don't even know where you are taking her to. Father, what are you saying? Yes. He has lost his position, his future crown, his money, comfort, everything because of me. It's only natural that I return the favor. I've made up my mind. Please don't discourage me. I am going with him. You know what? No, I go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's no way you can abandon your family and follow another oh. family now. Huh? Huh? Mother, he is not just my family, but also my future. Like I said before, my mind is made up. Uh, uh, Don't even try to... Amaka, stop this madness! Huh? And you, young man, please. Have you not caused us uh, mm. enough problems? Mm. Haven't you caused us enough pain? Why do you want to continue? You just want to add more. Moreover, I, I, I don't know. I, I don't know where, what is your fate. You just had to elope with my daughter to where I don't even know. I can't even tell. Please. Uh, what, what, what is this? I'm sorry, sir. I guess you are right. I guess I have to take my leave. Sweetheart, your parents are very correct. You stay with them. I'll face my feet alone, okay? Never. Yeah. You will go nowhere without me. Wherever you go, I go. No, no, listen, I don't want you to have to disobey your parents, okay? Please. Go go back. Do you want to disobey me, your father? Father, I am not disobeying you. I am only following my heart. No. Mm -mm. That's your answer. Take your bag inside. Go back. Ah, I'm, 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 I'm not going anywhere. 
Go inside. Chama, go and keep the bag inside now. Go inside and keep the bag. Father, I will push you. Eh? Push one more. I will push you. Go back, please. Chama, Father, Father, I will push you down. Push one down. I will push you down. Go back. Chama, Don't come How can you say? Go back. And you, no young sense. Man. Have you not caused enough, enough pain? I'm please. I'm go. Go. <laughs> Namaka, why this now? Drop this knife. Why? It's either you allow me go with the love of my life, or I'll be prepared to bury my corpse. Namaka, listen to me, my love. Put the knife away. Please. Please. No. Please, Please. Let, let her be. Let Not her be. until they give their consent. My daughter, please. Give your mother this knife, uh, please. Please. You think I'm a child, father? No. Please, please. Amaka, you're all that I have. Keep this knife. Amaka, Amaka, no. Amaka, please. Please. To go. Oh. Amaka. Be cool. Amaka. Be cool. Amaka. 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 True love never dies. What's up? What will be? Will be a gadi 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 the most important thing is that we are here, together, with no one to interfere. With no hope or destination? Our hearts will lead us to our destination. Your tenacity motivates me. You are my courage, my love. I wish I am. I'm just a frustrated outcast. And a king in another's heart. My heart. Obi. Come on, let's go. Let's go to wherever our hearts lead us to. Hmm? Okay. Come on, let's go. Obi Mo, Mikey, I pray. How are you? I'm good, I'm good. Nick, good afternoon. I greet you. What a surprise visit. Yeah. Mikey, uh, it's a very urgent situation. We need to talk. Okay. As I speak to you now, I'm homeless and helpless with her. And that's why I came to you to help me as my only friend. At least, I need a roof on top of my head. My prince, I sympathize with your situation. But uh, your father, our king, announced uh, through the blatant cryer that no one should offer any sort of help or assistance to you. Or, or else the person will face severe punishment. And I don't want to uh, put myself into any trouble. I don't think I can help you. Maki. I'm your buddy. Yeah, I know, but I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think I can do that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I would have loved to help, but I can't. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. Your father really said that. That was so heartless of him. He's not my father. Not anymore. All this, all this while he's been caging me. And making me dependent on him and, and, and royal household. Now look at the result. I don't have a friend. Nothing. 
I wish I could, I could be an independent man with, with, with a voice and a heart of my own. It's okay, my love. Don't blame yourself. You were only trying to be a good son. No regrets, okay? Like, you know, I don't have friends as well. I mean, the only friend I had was devilish in Didi. But however it is, we are going to, we are going to be fine. Going to be fine? How? How? You hurt him. He said the king has asked everyone not to help me. Who are we going to? It's okay, my love. If they can't help you, they can help me. Like I said, we will be fine. Hmm? Let's go. True I love so. never lies. I say so. True love never fails. No matter what it faces, true love must remain. True love never lies. True love never fails. No matter what it faces, true love must remain. What will be, will be. What are you doing here? Hmm. I've come to ask if you or your daughter knows my son's whereabouts. Indeed. Ibi When your son came here and stole my daughter away, he took my daughter to God knows where. Give me my child, though. You should give me my daughter. Take your son and give me my own daughter. Please. Anyway. It is obvious you are useless to the information I seek. I will leave your wretched presence. Jesus! Jesus! I want a wretched... Okay, I agree. I am useless. Forgive me, my daughter. Me, wretched. You should give me my daughter. Don't come to my wretched presence again. Give me my wretched daughter and take your son, Bikonu. Don't come here again, no. If you come here, some may change the look here. Don't come here again, mu wretched. Mu ma, so bad there. Onu a konyo wapuchi a kakonya. There's no problem. I'm wretched. So bad there.
know that Amaka has the shameless gods to come to my house and ask me to accommodate her without her decrowned prince. Hey, yeah. You could have helped her now, eh? If not for anything, for old time's sake. Eh? Mm. Help her. God forbid. Look, she has made it clear to me that she doesn't want me again, and that is fine now. Okay. That is how it stands. Look, she even came to my house with that man she cheated me for. Ah, what's That's that? Funny. Do not be unreasonable. Eh? She never cheated you. Both of you never had anything. We all know that you made your intention known towards her. Coco. Uh -huh. mm. Of which she declined it. So I don't see any, re any reason you should be angry. Uh -huh. Eh? Uh -huh. Look, let the man she's in love, or the man that loves her rather, provide shelter for her. Okay, uh -huh. What's that now? Are you the one saying this? Eh? You talk about her with a pronounced anger. That is envy. Oh yeah, tell me the truth. Do you still have feelings for her? No. That was in the past, not anymore. Look, do you know that? Uh -uh. As I'm speaking to you right now, I have somebody I'm in love with. Uh, and do you know uh, that <laughs> if I tell this lady that I love her like this, bam, she will accept me. She would even say no, she would just marry me straight. Are you serious? <laughs> you don't see hey, Oga Sonny, mm? that means it is obvious you are hiding things from me. You are Madam hiding Ma things from me. Madam Ada. Mm? <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, tell me, who could that be? Are you sure you want to know? I want to know. Are you sure you want to That's know? That's what you tell me now. I want to know. Okay. The lady sitting here with me is the one I'm talking about. Baba, stop this your jokes now. Eh? Talk to me. Who, who could that be now? I'm serious now. The lady sitting here with me. Which lady? What are you saying? How many people do we have here? <laughs> okay, sorry. I don't want to talk about this. Do you hear me? I don't want to talk about it. Why are you angry now? Uh -uh. Ada? What did I say? Ada? Kingdom since afternoon. Eh? I told you, let's go back to our own village. You refused. Go where? And to who? Where are we going? That will only worsen the situation. The king has already made us enemies of the kingdom. The best we can do for ourselves now is to stay here, struggle here, and survive here. You know what? First thing tomorrow morning, I will find something to do. I must find something to do. Uh, even if it's uh, uh, being a conductor or, or barrel pushing, something I would do. Tomorrow, Just, tomorrow you will find something to I do. I will find something to Just do. Just like that. Just like that. Baby. Okay, where are we going to sleep this night? Uh, we'll just find somewhere to lay our heads for tonight. It's just, it's just tonight. And you, you, you have to be patient. It's not easy. Patience is the order of the day. Who are you people? What are you doing here? Uh, <clears throat> my name is Obina. My goodness. It is you! Are you not the prince of Omonia Kingdom? Y yeah. <laughs> I said it! I said it! My prince! My prince, long live! I know you! I was at your village last year with my friend for your New Year festival and I saw you sitting with your father, the king. Really? Yes. My prince, 
What are you doing here? It's a long story. Oh, quite a pathetic story. Well, I work as a mason in this site. My name is Joseph. I'm an orphan. So I know how hard it could be to be homeless and helpless. I feel for you. And I'm willing to help you people. At least with a roof over your head in my little home. My home is not far from here. But you just wait for me. After today's job, we'll go. Because if I leave now, my boss will be mad at me. We will wait. Yes, we'll wait. Thank you. Thank you so much. Don't mention. It pays to help those in need. Okay? Thank you. Um, let me show you where to stay and wait for me till the work is over. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Yes. Come. yes. Once again, new people are welcome to my house. Hmm? Look, you can take this place as your own house. Feel free to do anything you like. Though I know it's not up to your standard, but you just have to manage it. Thank you. Joe, thank you so very much. I would not forget this in a hurry. Thank um. you. I'm very honored, my prince. My love, now that we have exhausted all that we have, what are we going to do? Joe, I noticed that he has nothing on him again because he has not been cooking or providing anything as he used to. Moreover, we can't keep depending on him for food, shelter, water, even our clothes. What are we going to do? How are we going to cope? How do we survive? We can't keep drinking Gary morning, afternoon, night. It's, it's, it's not healthy. I need to find something to do. Mm -hmm. In fact, I need to find anything, anything to do. Once we give me money so we can feed ourselves, it's okay. Anything. How do Joe give me cloth to wear? Joe is going to bring, give up. <laughs> hey, I got you. Ah, Joe. My prince. I'm with you. How are you people doing today? We are fine. You're welcome. Hello, uh, fine, as usual. How was work? Ah. Tedious as usual. <laughs> I'm sorry I've not been able to provide money for cooking since yesterday. When I was very broke. Hey, but thank God I have something now. <laughs> so that I make and prepare one of our special recipes for us. <laughs> I mean, one, please. 
Take this and prepare something nice for us. You might get some men. This is more than enough. Thank you so much. You're welcome. I'll hurry to the market now. Okay. Fast, eh? Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. Let me put water for you to bath before I go to the yeah. market. Thank you. Okay. Uh, Joe, Joe, please. Joe, please come. Good wife. Sit down, sit down. Yes, sir. Yes. Uh, Joe, I need us to talk man to man. Uh, My prince, I hope there's no problem. There's no problem. I need a favor from you. Huh? See, Andrew, is it possible that you talk to your ogre on my behalf so I can come and help in this missing work? You know, I just need something. I need, so, I need to do something so I will be able to feed myself and my wife. My prince. Uh, my prince, eh? Uh, wait, 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 Joe, stop. Stop calling me prince, prince. My name is Obina. Call me Obina Finch. Okay, sorry. Obina, mm -hmm. look, I don't think you know what you're asking me to do. That job is too tedious for someone like you. Eh? You won't be able to handle it. Me, at this point in time in my life, Joe, what are you talking? I can do anything, anything. Hence, is going to give me money to feed myself and my wife. I don't have a problem. Anything. Please, now, just talk to your guy for me. That's all I want. You sure you can do it? I can do it. Okay. Get yourself prepared. Tomorrow we'll go. Ha. Thank you. Thank you very much, Joe. Anything for you, Thank my you friend. very uh, much, eh? Obina. Tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow morning I'll wake you up. <laughs> no problem. You people have not even started taking the air. Your Highness, you have to go and look for our son and bring him back home. How can you be this wicked to your own blood? How? I have made my decisions, and that is final. Mm. That boy is no longer my son. And if you want to join him, good, you can do that. But I bet you, mark my words, he is not coming back to this palace anymore. No! Unless he comes back to his senses. I said no, I disagree with you this time around. Go there and look for my son. Go and bring my son back! Bring him back! Go you? out there and get my son back for me! How dare you? Talk back at me. <sighs> my love, what is it? You don't seem to be very happy. What happened? <laughs> I'm happy. I'm, I'm happy. Of course I'm happy. Can't you see? It's, it's just that this, this thing came out at the wrong time. Uh, look at us. We are helpless. Living under somebody's roof. Huh? Sit. My love. Children are gifts from God. He always makes a way for them. I, I don't believe that this came at the wrong time. No. God will always make a way for us. Okay? And uh, I intend to start something small to support you. Intend to start something small? Yes. Something like what? 